to go. Oh, these two are touching wheels. Pagano and Sato touching wheels on the front straight. How do you guys do this? <laughs> uh, we don't anymore. I'll tell you what, one guy you're not going to scare to back out is Takuma Sato. He is as fearless as they come. Simon Pagano trying to hold him tight. This is crazy. Well, they're as close as they've ever run tonight. It looks like a formation lap for a sprint car race. These two guys are touching wheels again. Sato slides up the track and Kanan slices down the inside. That's the move Tony Kanan needed to challenge for the win. Here comes Graham Rahal looking at Sato, but now I think Tony Kanan has the space to try to fight for this thing to the end. Eight laps to go, seven at the line. So Kanan's in that second in TT data car. That's him on board right Going now. For third. Battling got, for third position, but it's three wide. three wide now. And he made it. Sato, Sato made it. Sato hangs tough on the outside and shoves out Simon Pagano back to fifth place. Or did he back out like he did last year, decide to live to fight to the finish? I got a feeling these the two best cars right now are Sato and Kanan. They're both looking for a way around these leaders, but you're going to have to do a three wide like this. No attack, no chance to Kuma Sato making it stick two laps in a row on the high side up where nobody's been willing to go before, and he slots in the third. Power stays out in front. That's Dixon right behind him. Sato in the second blue car. Kanan is the third blue car running in fourth. Sato coming to the bottom side of Scott oh! Dixon, and they turn. Dixon goes around. Sato goes around. Power is in front. Oh. Well, you knew it was going to happen at some <laughs> point. They were absolutely driving like maniacs. Scott Dixon is going to be furious, as he should be. Connor Daly also collected. This 